All right, what's happening out there, everybody? I was telling a lot of people about my new computer setup here, and especially about this new USB dock thing that I got. I just found uh, I found out these exist recently, and they're pretty awesome. So a lot of people wanted to know more about it, and it was kind of hard to explain without seeing it. So I thought I'd make a video and show you guys. So if any of you guys out there do a lot of work on computers like I do, this is just like an amazing piece of equipment to have. So what we have going on here is this is my current setup right now. I uh, just got this uh, new laptop for Christmas. It's total beast. It's like a gaming laptop. It's really powerful. I'm pretty stoked on it so far. Uh, but I went out and I got a 27-inch monitor here. And I'm liking that a lot too. And this over here is actually an old... It used to be a 24-inch television, but it has a VGA hookup on it, so... I've been using it as a monitor for a long time. I used to actually just have this screen sitting over here where this one is. And I had an old laptop hooked up here, so that's how that used to work. But now i got all this new stuff. So, this is all three of these displays here are connected, so they're running extended. So what that basically means, if you don't know, is if I open something here, I can just click and drag it across any screen that I want. They're all just basically connected together here. Which I find extremely useful because I do all my work on the computer primarily and I have dozens of things open sometimes so having the extra screen to put stuff has made my workflow a lot better. And uh, But to make all this possible I was kind of researching how I could hook up some extra monitors or at least one extra monitor my old laptop would not support more than one extra monitor, and I wanted at least two. So I came across these pluggable USB devices, and I might put a link to it, but there's actually the guy that created pluggable had a YouTube video out, and he had seven displays all hooked up to one laptop with a bunch of these <clears throat> adapters, and I thought it was pretty awesome. So I was looking at their stuff, and they make this thing called the USB dock, which allows you to uh, plug in all your stuff to that and then it just runs to your computer with one USB 3.0 cord. So I'll get a little bit more into that here in a minute. I'll show you closer, but it's, uh, I don't know, it's, it's the size of a small internet modem, more or less. <clears throat> and you could put that anywhere. You could hide it in a cabinet or you know behind something or up on a shelf or somewhere out of sight. I typically have a like a picture in front of that so you can't see all the wiring and stuff. But I have my USB, my mouse, and my keyboard hooked into it. I've got my printer hooked into that. There's a cable ran from my modem for my internet which is run through that also. It has a DVI output on there and it comes with an adapter so you can run VGA off of that which I'll show you here shortly. So this screen right here is run off the VGA port on that. And then below that is an HDMI plug-in, which is what runs this screen right here. And then below that you just have uh, the one USB 3.0 cord that runs over here to my laptop. And just a power cord. So on the back of that there's actually four just regular USB or USB 2.0 ports. You can plug in whatever devices or a memory stick or you know wireless stuff whatever anything and then all the other stuff on the back and then there's actually two more USB 3.0 ports on the front of that so I could plug in two more things to that if I want or Pluggable also makes display adapters that go from USB 3.0 to either VGA or HDMI so if I really wanted to I could order two of those adapters I could hook up two more monitors to that thing if I wanted to which would be pretty awesome so if I had a slightly different desk or a different setup I could have like a big screen up there I could have uh, well give me five displays I could have like four monitors plus like a TV or something up there all extended if I wanted to or any combination of those and you can run your devices in a portrait or landscape mode so I'm pretty stoked on that. It was only like, I think $94 on Amazon, so not too outrageous. I looked around at Best Buy, and Best Buy does carry 
USB docks, but they don't have quite the same hookups, and I don't think they're as good as this one is, and they're like twice the price also. So this is pretty awesome, and um, to make it work, more or less, when I bought it off Amazon, Pluggable sent a driver in the email to me, and when I got it, I just installed the driver, plugged this in, and it worked flawlessly, absolutely no issue at all. And there's no lag in this, so if I move my mouse across the screens, there's there's no lag in when I move the mouse or, or between when I move the mouse and the actual arrow moving or anything like that. So it's totally spot on. Uh, I've actually hooked up, when I first hooked this up, I put a different browser on each screen and I, I put a uh, HD full screen YouTube video on each display and they all played just perfectly. So it has lots of power or at least everything worked good. My, my laptop's got a really awesome video card and lots of RAM and stuff, <clears throat> so that helped. But everything works, so I literally have all of my cabling, all my devices and everything just plugged into that back there. It's hidden out of the way, and it all runs just off this one cord totally flawlessly, which I'm excited about because my old laptop I, I had here, I didn't have that, so I used to have like the power cord, the VGA cable, the network internet cable was plugged in over here and then on this side I had like actually a little USB hub deal plugged in that my mouse and keyboard went to and then I had like a USB hard drive over there and I had my speakers hooked in and my microphone and it just was like cables and a huge rat's nest of mess and trying to clean around it and just deal with it, it was kind of a hassle so Plus, if I want to take my laptop somewhere and use it, that was like a real pain to unplug everything and pack it up and then hook it all back up again when I got back. So this, this has two things and I'm out of here. I can unplug that USB and that power cord and I'm gone. So I'm pretty excited about it. Like I usually run, uh, I'll have like Photoshop over here on this screen or something and I have lots of notes for various projects that I have open over here a lot of times or like file folders. Then on this screen, I'll run like my browsers a lot. So if I'm working on a website or something, it's been pretty convenient. So I can just make a an image over here or whatever and upload it to the website on this side. Or, you know, I do like Facebook ads and stuff. So just having all this extra space has been really handy. And being able to expand it some more is going to be even better. So anyways, I'll go back here and show you guys this thing up close and show you how the plugins on it and stuff. All right, so this is the USB dock. It's a pluggable UD-3900. You can find them online. Their website's pluggable.com. You can also find them on Amazon and stuff like that. But if you run a laptop at home a lot of the times, or if you're just sick of having all kinds of stuff plugged into your computer, I highly recommend this thing because you can run all your cabling and hook all your stuff up to this and just hide it somewhere in the back of a cabinet or a drawer somewhere out of sight and just have like one cord running to your computer. So what we got on this thing, on the front it's got indicator lights for power and USB connection. It also has two USB 3.0 ports on the front, which these are the, the higher speed ones. So like I said in the, the last clip there, you can get more display adapters from these guys if you want and plug them in here and then uh, if you have a desktop computer, you could actually run like four extra monitors off of this. I have a laptop, so my, my laptop screen is also included in this, but I could run like four more displays uh, plus my laptop screen if I wanted to. So if I turn this around here to look on the back of it, we can see here. So on the top, there's four regular, just their USB 2.0 ports. They're kind of the slower ones, but they're just like what everyone has, more or less. So you plug. These work great for like a, a wire or like a, uh, a USB mouse or a keyboard, or you can put a memory stick in there. I've got my printer plugged into this also. So any kind of just regular USB device you want to run, you can plug into one of those four ports there. I still have one extra one. And then you've got the network cable, so you can plug your internet into this. It'll run through to your computer. Uh, I haven't noticed any lag in my internet speed or anything like that. I also have a like a network hard drive plugged into my modem 
that is also basically uh, running through this one line too off the modem and I haven't had any issue with that I can access it from my computer just fine saves and, and the write speed has been pretty fast too so not an issue there and then this is the DVI port some monitors, TVs and stuff have DVI on them already, so if you had a cable you could just run that straight over. But it does have this it does come with this adapter when you order it, so you can run VGA. So it's DVI to VGA. So this is what I have this other uh screen right here plugged in with this. And then you've got the HDMI port underneath this, and that's what's running my 27 inch screen over there. This is the the one USB 3.0 cable that runs everything. This is what connects this device to my laptop. And then just a power cord. So I'm pretty stoked to have all of this junk plugged in onto this device, which is normally hidden behind a picture back here. And not all this cabling that I used to have just all over the place here plugged into my laptop. So if you happen to have a like an Apple computer, they do make a newer one of these. It's uh, USB-C compatible, so it'll it'll run power. You can charge your laptop off of it or whatever, and it's a faster connection. I think it'll go. F what is it? Um, I want to say 40 gigs per second speed. I'm not sure if that's entirely right or not. But on that particular USB dock, if you look it up, you can plug it in with uh, like your Thunderbolt 3, also I believe, or the USB-C on your Apple. And it has a like 4K capability. So one of the HDMI ports on the back of that one, which it has two on that particular USB dock, you can run a 4K display off of that at 60 hertz from that one port. And then you can run another display just with HDMI, which is pretty awesome. And then you could also get other display adapters, you know, just the USB ones to run with this also. So but maybe check that out. I just wanted to run regular USB 3.0 on this, so this device worked great for me. Anyway, so just wanted to give you guys a rundown on this. I know a lot of my friends and stuff run, do graphic design, or there's a few other web designer people out there, some other content marketers and different people I know that might find this information useful. So uh, I found it extremely awesome to be able to hook up extra screens for my workflow and I'm sure you might too so check this stuff out pluggable.com it's pretty reasonably priced and uh, I'll catch you guys later